My aunt is diagnosed with fibroadenomas. Is it precancerous and what are its treatment options? Fibroadenomas are one of the most common breast problems patients come to OPD with. If we do 100 breast biopsies, out of them 50 of them will be fibroadenomas. These are benign pathologies most of the times which are generally found in younger populations from the age of 20 to 35 years of age groups. They can be single or sometimes multiple. Nearly 20% of the times they will be multiple in numbers and can be found in both the breasts. Though the exact reason for fibroadenomas is not known, a mild relation with the hormonal secretion is uh, scientifically proven. Sometimes these fibroadenomas increase in size during pregnancies. Most of these are non-cancerous conditions, but some complex fibroadenomas with some atypical features are considered as precancerous conditions. So how do we manage these fibroadenomas? If the fibroadenomas are smaller in size and are not producing any symptoms, then those fibroadenomas can be just managed conservatively and should be put upon regular follow-up. But if the fibroadenomas are increasing in size or they are measured more than 5 cm and if they have any complex features in the histopathology when we do a biopsy, such fibroadenomas need to be surgically excised. The other treatment options you have for fibroadenomas is if the patient doesn't want to undergo a surgical excision, then you can also do a cryoablation in those cases. But before doing a cryoablation, you have to do a core needle biopsy and prove that there are no oncological features in the biopsy specimen.